What's up guys, this is IW Rocker, welcome to another video and today I'm talking about I got a new workhorse for the property and uh, no, it's not that red truck and trailer over there no, it's not nothing else, it's not that mower up there but it is indeed this 2008 Easy Go TXT gas golf cart with the little truck bed and tailgate yeah Okay guys, this is going to be a pretty quick and concise video, but you know what? I'm pretty excited about this purchase. This is a easy go TXT gas golf cart. And uh, as you can see there, easy go Textron company. And uh, this thing is awesome. So uh, I do have a pretty big property here, which I never highlight on my videos much, but you know what? With all this quarantine and time off, you know, I. Uh, I really have done a lot around here and still have a mountain of work to do and uh, I really need a machine you know that's a lot easier to maneuver smaller and uh, less damaging to the grass than that thing over there and you know this is the answer uh, I looked at UTVs and I looked at golf carts and you know what this is the answer right here this is perfect for me not only a golf cart over a UTV but a gas golf cart over electric as well I will have tons of videos explaining property management, what to use for these vehicles, uh, whether it be trucks or you know whatever, and uh, why this is going to serve me well, and uh, why I chose this as a basically a workhorse around the property. Uh, not to mention it's fun as well, and uh, it's really good shape. I got a good deal, so I'm very thankful. As you can see, the highlights. It does have a cargo box, and uh, I obviously wanted this. I don't care for a rear seat. I don't need that. Um, I can haul two or three people if we squish in there if I need, but uh, it's mostly just me and I can fit a lot in this box and that we are going to be using that today in video. This has a lot, a lot of uses for uh, if you have property. So, um, you know, use your imagination. You can do a lot with this. You can even haul stuff with it. Um, it has hitches front and back and uh, you can haul a lot in the bed. This does hold in standard configuration with just the uh, two leaf springs. It does hold about 350 to 400 pounds and then if I need to which I doubt I'll need I can get HD leaf spring add-ons uh, for thicker and more leaf springs in back if I need to haul more payload so that's pretty cool this is in good shape for 2008 um, it is a gas if we look under here it has the 13 and a half horse Kawasaki motor which is great because uh, it's a good unit has more than enough power for what I need um, and you know what it's very reliable Kawasaki makes makes very good motors so i um, pretty happy with that pretty cool you can see on the steering wheel here some old numbers engraved in there I don't know if it'll show up on camera too well but uh, you can see some scorecard numbers from probably it's X life as a golf cart at some point I love this color combo the uh, green with the tan and the black as well but don't get me wrong, I am going to customize this a little bit. i got to make it my own. But uh, it is your standard gas, gas and brake, parking brake set, steering wheel, four cup holders, two cubbies, a little space here, your ignition key. And then, uh, obviously, this came with a windshield folded down. You can fold it back up so it's a two-piece windshield. Very lucky to have that. As well as the roof as well as an option because some base golf carts don't have a roof. And we have an LED light pod that engages whenever you're in gear. Very, very cool. Probably won't need it much, but I'm glad I have it. And then, like I said, the cargo box is the main reason this is rear wheel drive, obviously, and gas powered. Very happy with this purchase. So, I won't bore you with today's chore with this thing already. Picking up a crap load of sticks that fall from all these trees around the yard as I have to mow early in the morning. And uh, mowing here, I take very seriously. I want to do a good job. And uh, it's a lot to mow. And we got a storm a couple days ago, and it knocked, of course, a bunch of branches, twigs, and yada yada down. 
So uh, I got to pick those up and then I want a nice mow. I want a nice clean mow tomorrow when I wake up I can come out here and just hop on the mower and get it done. And so that is what we're going to do today with this and uh, let's see how it goes. Okay so now you see that the bed is full. This uh, is a pretty good little cargo box I got to be honest but uh, I filled this up with a lot of twigs and sticks that fell from a storm we had a couple days ago. Like I said, I am going to mow in the morning, so usually I have to do this by foot, and it takes forever, and it's such a pain in the ass. And uh, now, I can drive around, throw them in the bed in this, and get it all done at once. And so now I'm going to go dump it over there. I'll show you how the box and the tailgate works. But uh, this is really panning out to be super cool and a super useful tool, uh, one of the many things you can do with these. So, um, yeah, let's go dump this out. We're going to dump it out way over there on the other side of my truck in the uh, trailer. So let's go. This thing goes way fast, by the way. Like you can't even floor it in here. It's too bumpy. Way fast. There's our dumping spot. Got a reverse beeper as well. Good enough. Okay, and now let me turn that beeper off real quick. Okay, and now the tailgate is pretty cool, pretty easy as well. We got these latches right here. Let's pull on these. Like so, out, out and over, and then boom, it drops the tailgate, and there you go. Now you can brush all this stuff out into the junk pile, and we're good. Man, being a YouTuber really pays off, I tell you what. Okay, let's close her up. Doing this with the camera here, because it's that easy. Boom, tailgate's closed. Box is cleaned up, good enough. Let's head on up. So you know what guys, that is gonna wrap up this video. I hope you enjoyed this and uh, learned something about property management. These things are awesome. And uh, these things can really help you out. I know it's gonna make a huge difference in time efficiency around my property and doing lots of chores around the house. So. Uh, it's a fun way to do it and it really helps out and speeds up the process and does a lot of good. So um, strongly consider a golf cart. Um, they're a lot cheaper than UTVs and uh, you know UTVs are awesome and maybe someday if I'm you know not so cheap maybe I'll get one but you know what right now I don't see it. These things are awesome and uh, I'll have more videos on this uh, regarding this topic and why these can help you out. This thing is awesome, a lot of fun and uh, it really is going to be a workhorse build for me. I will do some stuff to this, like I said, and uh, we'll see where this goes. But uh, I'm very happy with this purchase. And uh, this EasyGo TXT gas golf cart is awesome and showing its worth already. So, um, like I said, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Throw a like on there if you did, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And stay safe, and like always, I'll catch you later.